Pohamba retires this month. The award committee noted that during his 10-year rule, he managed to improve the lives of his people, ensuring gender equality, higher literacy rates, access to treatment to over 80% of persons living with HIV AIDS, as well as the introduction of social safety nets for the poor and persons living with disability. During the decade of his presidential mandate, he demonstrated sound and wise leadership. At the same time, he maintained his humility throughout his presidency. He was deeply committed to the rule of law and to the respect for the Constitution, in particular on the issue of term limit. The award launched in 2007 by Sudanese tycoon Mo Ibrahim has only been awarded three times. In other years, no retired president met the criteria according to the committee. The criteria are quite, quite rigorous and they applied for to, to everyone. To win the prize, the leader must have left office in the last three years, been democratically elected, handed over power peacefully and changed the lives of his or her people. Other winners of the prestigious award our former presidents Joachim Chisan of Mozambique, President Festus Mohai of Botswana, President Pedro Pires of Cap Verde, as well as President Nelson Mandela of South Africa, who got an honorary award. Sarah Kimani, SBC News, Kenya.